What is kidney cancer? Kidney cancer, or renal cancer, is a disorder that affects the kidneys. Kidneys are the two bean-shaped organs located at the back of your body on either side. It functions in the filtration and cleansing of blood by removing the waste and in the formation of urine. In kidney cancer, the growth of kidney cells becomes uncontrollable, resulting in the formation of a tumor which is malignant or cancerous in nature. There are several types of kidney cancer, as discussed further. Renal cell carcinoma is the most common type of kidney cancer. This type of cancer affects the proximal tubules of your kidney. This portion of the kidney is responsible for the production of primary urine. Urothelial carcinoma is another type of renal cancer, also known as transitional cell carcinoma, not as common as renal cell carcinoma and constitutes about 5 to 10% of the cases. It affects the renal pelvis, the portion where urine is collected before moving to the bladder. Sarcomas can appear at multiple sites in your body. It is a broad term used for the cancers occurring in bones and soft tissues. Kidney sarcoma is very rare and affects the soft tissues of the kidney. Wilms tumor is most common in children, though it consists of about only 1% of the total kidney cancer cases. The treatment strategy for this type is different and will be discussed later in this video. Lymphomas can result in the enlargement of both the kidneys, characterized by enlarged lymph nodes, also called lymphadenopathy. There is a very rare occurrence of lymphomas in kidneys. If suspected, a biopsy is advised for the confirmation. The cause of kidney cancer is still not clear. Still, there are several risk factors that contribute to the development of kidney cancer. For example, smoking, hypertension, obesity, chemical exposure, specifically herbicides, family history of kidney disease, etc. In the early stages, kidney cancer usually stays asymptomatic, no symptoms, and there are no specific tests available that can detect cancer in the absence of symptoms. The symptoms may appear in later stages, which include weight loss with no apparent cause, decreased appetite, fatigue, intermittent fever, and blood in the urine, etc. Tests and scans used to diagnose kidney cancer include blood and urine tests, imaging tests, ultrasounds, MRI, and CT scans, and biopsy. Imaging tests allow us to visualize the kidney's structural changes and tumor, and in a biopsy, a small cell sample is taken to detect abnormalities. Once the lesion is identified and confirmed as cancer, then your doctor might suggest you get a CT scan to determine the stage of cancer. Kidney cancer is classified further into four stages. In stage one, the tumor is confined to the kidney and is smaller in size. As it progresses over to stage two, the tumor size increases, but it remains confined to the kidney. In stage three, the tumor starts to spread to surrounding tissues of the kidney and may spread in lymph nodes. In stage 4, the cancer metastasizes and moves to distant parts of the body, such as liver, bones, and lungs, etc. The good news is that most of the kidney cancers get diagnosed before metastasis. Two treatment strategies are available, depending upon the type and stage of cancer, for example, surgical and non-surgical. Surgical treatments include nephrectomy, in which the entire kidney is removed, and partial nephrectomy, in which only the tumor and some surrounding tissues are removed. The second method is preferred as it enables the preservation of the kidney's function and prevents long-term complications. Non-surgical treatments utilize techniques to destroy tumors without surgery. Cryoablation is a process that uses cold gas to freeze the cancer cells and prevent them from multiplying. Radiofrequency ablation, on the other hand, is used to burn the cancer cells with the help of a probe containing electricity. Medication therapies are also available to treat kidney cancers. Keep a check on your symptoms and health conditions to identify any abnormality in time so that it can be treated effectively. We hope that you are learning something new every day from our videos. If you'd like to know about a specific topic, inbox us, email us, or comment down below.